dropping. Yo, back out of the jumps. I'm uh, actually ready to start building the roll in for the bone log. I need to take that thing down, clear the trees, so I can get more speed for the monster. But yeah, finally got a saw that I could, hopefully can cut down the um, the trees with. So see how it goes. I'm gonna set this up as a try time lapse and uh, just get on with it really. No messing about. All right, time lapse it. Cool. So we got all that chopped down. Getting down alright, it was a bit of a faff, but got it to work. Now I'll show you how much space I've got to play with. <sighs> yeah. So much more space up here now. So the view you've probably all seen is me dropping in. And I've got to clear all that. I'm gonna build a platform that's like up here somewhere, I think. So you can hop in. Be way faster. Less sketchy. And just a bit more fun to ride. All right, I'm gonna try and work out. I'm gonna build a platform up here. All right, this is what I've done so far. Getting the A frame, it's not square or anything. I've got to try and get it solid so then I can adjust it to make it square. If that makes sense. It's so awkward doing this on your own, trying to get stuff to be level and stuff. But I'm getting there. I'm winning. <sighs> so tiring. I think my battery's gonna run out before I finish it, but just means I have to come back up tomorrow and finish the job. But, all right, let's get back on it. Yeah, all right, so I'm done for today. All my batteries have died, but I've got somewhat of a platform. It's uh, not very square, it's not very straight, but it should be solid once I uh, tie it in properly. But yeah, looks all right. Then I come into this, then you come down into here, then down at that. So, should be all good. Uh, yeah, batteries all run out, so I'm gonna have to come back tomorrow and try and finish it off, but Shouldn't be too bad. Hope you've got enough wood. But I'm sure we will be able to jimmy something together. All right, back out again. Next day, continuing with the rolling for the, for the uh, bone log. Um, just trying to work out how I'm going to make it a bit more secure because it's a bit wobbly at the minute, so I need to put some more triangulation in it. And then uh, I'll try and deck it out and see how she looks. Um, definitely get way more speed, especially because you should be able to hop into it now. And it should be all good. Yeah, I'll set a time lapse up and uh, get cracking. All right, it's pretty much kind of done. It is the sketchiest thing in the world, I love it. Um, but now I need to try and put some boards on it so you can actually stand on it. Uh, I need to try and find some though, because I haven't got any left. But hopefully, I think there's some decking boards on the side I can use. Um, and just see if I can make something work with that. And then session on. So it's getting there. Got the face on. I used three pallets in the end. I had them lying around and I kind of ran out of wood. So I've got three pallets on the on the top for the like, face to roll in on. But all my decking boards have run out of them. So I'm gonna have to go somewhere I can buy some wood tomorrow. Buy some wood to uh, finish off the deck. I need some screws as well, completely out of screws. So that's the job for tomorrow. And then come up and finish it off. And then ride it. Yep, back again. Day number three building this roll in. Finally went and bought some new got some more lumber. So hopefully I can get it all finished off and then ride it. <sighs> getting a bit bored of building this roll in now. It's taking forever, but got all the stuff now, so I should be getting it done today. Then session. Alright, get back on the tools again. Done, finally. Take you up there so you can have a look. But, so yeah, pallets for the rolling bit because just it works, didn't really do anything else than that. Uh, I could put them in the three pieces and just screw them in, so nice and quick. And now the deck. Yeah, lovely, it's big enough to, I think you get two people up here quite happily. Um, can't even see where you're going because of the tree in the way, but 
to give you loads more speed. And then I need to do now is just chisel that away to make it a little bit smoother for the rolling. And then it'd be all good to go. Excited. All right, I know I uh, attack that and then uh, put some pads on and ride. Shouldn't be much longer, I promise. All right, pads are on, ready to go. Rolling's there. Smoothed out quite a bit and uh, raked and swept all the rocks out of the way so it's a little bit nicer to run into. And yeah, well, the only thing now is to actually try it. I oh, mean, so much faster. All right, just carry the bike up there. I'm gonna put the GoPro on my head and uh, I might set this one up somewhere else to get a wider angle. Uh, and here comes the first thing to be hard to do, climb up there with the bike. Not really the best access at the moment. I'm going to try and climb it like a ladder, I think. Oh, that's not that bad. Bit awkward. Let's get your toes in between. Yeah, there'd definitely be enough room for two people, I feel, like I said. Just be a little bit wide, just got to be, put a bit of support down there, I think. But I think it'd be all good. Well, I'm just going to hop in and roll and see how I do first run. And uh, see what the speed's like. Alright, dropping. Oh, how deep. Oh, that speeds. You're going fast now. I don't miss the valley, you're going to go fast. Far down to land. Quite a way down. Okay. I'm going to have to drag the bone log back. Don't even know how I'm going to do that. <laughs> wow, that was sick. Cool, that makes things a lot nicer. I guess I have gone up like four foot, so four foot high for a big flat takeoff. All right, let's do this again. Now I'm used to the speed. Try and do it a little bit nicer. And uh, not land flat. All right, go again. Still trying to get used to the speed, so I'm just going to cruise through again. We'd like to three it today at some point. Get some riding done. All right, driving. All right, best three this. Both my mouth said I was going to do it, so best get on with it. Bit scared because it's so much bigger. But, right, let's get it done. Oh, that's so much nicer for threes. Oh, that's actually dreamy. Felt like I landed pretty good then. Oh, I didn't land too far down. I think I've got it set now, boys. So sick, so tight for that. Oh, I can sleep well tonight then. Um, tempted to go ride the airbag for 20 minutes or something. So stoked that worked. Um, definitely gonna ride up here some more though, but I wanna come up and ride with some people because it's a bit scary riding stuff on your own, especially onto this sort of stuff because it is pretty big. Um, I'm actually gonna go ride the airbag for a bit, pump that sucker up and do some riding but I'm gonna try some stuff that I don't want you to know about. So you're not coming along, but I'm gonna to head to the woods tomorrow night and film some stuff up there for you guys. So next clip will be in the woods, on the trail bike, smashing some turns. All right, dropping. So I'm now in the woods. Yeah, next day I'm in the woods. Um, I'm actually gonna ride down the track that I've been filming and riding on recently. Um, some of the locals have extended it. So where I had the big flat track turn after the bigger step down they've actually built about 30 foot berms actually massive into a little left hip um not much more we talking about i was going to show you so yeah i'm gonna drop in 
just start a bit further up the hill now. A little double, jump up there. Big Scandi flick, dropping in. Into the loosely corners. Foot firm, new hip. Right so, yeah, that new track's sick. See what the locals have built the big berm at the bottom and the new little hip. Um, jump at the bottom could definitely be made bigger, but the locals are riding it. If they made it bigger, they would actually die. So, it's still sick. Makes it that track finished and it's pretty rad. Um, I'm going to pedal up and ride one of the other tracks and then come back over and session this one for a bit and then uh, head home. But, yeah, pedal up the hill time. Ugh. Track number two, probably one of my favourite tracks here, it's pretty straight, pretty quick but a few little tight corners in it and a bit, it's going to be so loose today. Oh it's just dusty. Track is fun. Right, push back up, do the next one. Original old track I used to build about four years ago, I think this one is. Didn't to Sam Gill. Old friend who's ride BMX with, and now I ride a motor quite a lot. Kid can ride a bike. Oh, it's dusty. <laughs> that track is fun. Different track again. Same exit at the bottom, but different top section. That bottom bit is sick. Yeah. Ready for the follow? Let's go. Close? Try to. There's a uh, bit of a step down we built a few weeks ago. You kind of go from up there all the way down to that tree. And Sam's got a brand new bike and he wants to send it. Go on in.
trying to stop quite hard at the moment because it's so dry. Yeah, buddy. That's it. All right, he's coming again. He wants it. He reckons get more speed and go further. So, only one way to find out. Here he comes. Dropping. Oh, that was sick. Good little evening session. Good to bump into Sam as well. I've someone to follow for a bit. But yeah, just heading home. Need a shower, get changed, and then on to the next adventure. I'll uh, see you in the next one. Peace.